What's up, YouTube? This Rose go back again with another video, and I check it out. Brooklyn pastor uh, and his wife were robbed on live stream. They was having a, a service on live people. Now, there is a video of this robbery. It's floating around the internet like crazy. You can't miss it. Just look up. A pastor was robbed. $400,000. I guarantee you what? It's going to come up. Message. Get to this. Get to this. Now, between the pastor and his wife, they had on $400,000 worth of jewelry. That's what I'm getting from this. I just want to know. It's not why do they have $400,000 worth of jewelry between themselves. It's more of why come to church with this shit on? Huh? Is everybody in your congregation balling like this? Is this them people monies? Anyway. That they have been given paying tithes and whatnot. Now, the damn robbers are seen on this footage. And they are telling people, hey, get down. Don't nobody move. Get down. Don't nobody move. They're going towards the pastor. And I'm assuming the wife as well. Because some of this stuff you don't see. You just see little parts of it. And now some people are saying that they also got the congregation as well. I don't know if they had time to do all that. Because it, it, it looked like a pretty nice size church all right pretty nice size church the pastor says they robbed him then they left then the pastor runs after them he realized he didn't have his keys he's like hey give me my keys he said yeah they didn't know we had cameras they got under a white bins a cls i believe he said bins You know he balling when you know what kind of bins they was in. Like, I don't know if he really synced the back of it and was like, yeah, that's a CLS. He just knew that damn body style. He knew that he knew that damn body style because he about got one. His wife, his wife probably got one, a compressor or something. So, people, the pastor gets in his car and he says, actually, I rolled past him. And I seen them changing clothes. Took off the mask. They had masks on. <laughs> this is my thing about this story. Now, I've read a lot of comments on different people's uh, pages, YouTube pages, because it's, it's all over the Internet. Everybody's talking about it, right? And I'm with some of those people in the comments because they were saying it seems like an insurance claim fraud thing. You know what I'm saying? I get it because it's like... Okay, you know what I'm saying? Now, the preacher did do a response. That's how I got the information. He, that video is going around too. His response on this. And that's how I got what he said as far as allegedly running after the car and that, that this and that and this and that, right? So my thing again about this story is it did it does seem a little fishy. Shame on the people who did this though, because you bold as hell. <laughs> Got some big cojones now. But and that karma's gonna be bad. Now, if this is fake, as when I say fake, I'm talking about if this is a uh you know, some type of insurance scheme, claim scheme thing, that's crazy too. Now, somebody made a point in, in somebody's comments I read because they said all they had to do was pawn the jury if they wanted, you know what I'm saying, some money. But you got to think, if this is fake and they were in on this shit, allegedly, they'll still have their jury and the insurance claim money. So you got to think about that too. Huh? They be like, yeah, we gonna you gonna get my get my jury back and we gonna split the money. Looking ass, you know what I'm saying? Now I think it was two two guys. It could have been four. I don't remember. It was two or four guys. And the preacher said, yeah, they were all black. 
<laughs> it was some black guys that did this. This is a damn shame. I can't believe, you know, but, and then, and then it makes me think like, it had to be somebody you know. Either somebody you know, somebody been coming to your church, da da this and that. Um, and if I had a church, I would make it my business to really personally, personally know everybody that's coming to my church. That way, I would know when a new person came. Like, I would know. You know what I'm saying? Come on, man. Come on, man. So, this story is crazy as hell, people. I got, my last question is, to conclude this video is, why the hell? And he looks kind of like a street dude when I seen a picture of him. When he just had on like a, a he had a, a Gucci suit on, what was it? No, it was a Fendi suit. Then he had a Fendi, he had a Fendi, Fendi blazer on and a Fendi uh, collar shirt. You know what I'm saying? And it had Fendi design all on the collar right there. Jewelry. You know what I'm saying? I mean, he's looking like a, a dope dealer. You know what I'm saying? Because what they say about preachers, they ain't number pimps. Man, I said, allegedly, man. Allegedly, man. They got game, though, for your ass. See what I'm saying? So, so they fit. Hold on now. They do fit in the pimp world. They fit in that pimp world, all right? Because a lot of these preachers, I ain't saying him, though, but a lot of these preachers, they be pimping their congregation, and they go and they go after the women. Mm-hmm. They really go after the women. Hmm. People, what do y'all think about this? The damn preacher and his wife got what? Robbed on live stream in a damn church. They got over four, they, they got $400,000 worth of jewelry. So you mean to tell me this man and this woman has $400,000 worth of jewelry? What's in their damn bank account? They are millionaires. Message. I don't care if it's only one million. They are millionaires. You hear me? In this damn church. Now, are they giving back to the people like they should? Are they giving back to the people like they should? Huh? They ain't talking about like $100. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Give them people some damn money. And, they, and, 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 and this, getting robbed, maybe this is... God trying to wake your ass up. Maybe this is God trying to wake your ass up. Because one thing I noticed, one thing I noticed, the, the videos are floating around, like I said, and his response, while he was talking, he was doing a whole lot of this. Yeah, he just kept rubbing them, he just kept doing the bird, man. Yeah, rubbing them damn hands together, doing this shit. Mm-hmm, and this shit. While he's talking, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I'll be the judge of this. All right, I would show the video. Uh, I'm not. I'm not even gonna show this video, but it is floating around, and it, it's very, very short video. Like everybody is not really trying to show all of it. You know what I'm saying? So that's what's up. But his response, you know, it, it's just crazy, y'all. Yeah, I'll be the judge. Message.